Welcome back to part two of Batman the Telltale series episode five guys. We're going to continue where we left off right about now. That was a bit loud. Okay, so now we're back in the back cave. How go the repairs? Probably not great. Going offline kept Penguin from finding the bad cave. But it also scrambled our system. Probably worth a trade. Worse, most of my tech isn't working. It's going to take time to get everything up and running again. If it gets running again, doesn't matter. Going to make and let Penguin in. The Arkham. A hell of a lot harder. You've proven that you don't need armor or gadgets to help this city. In the end, Bruce Wayne was the one to stop Penguin. Bruce, these last few weeks, well, it just happens to be a stool there. They've taken on you, facing off against Harvey and Oswald in a matter of days. But not just the physical toll. Those were men you once trusted, and after finding out what you did about your father, people must seem a great disappointment to you. People have always been a disappointment always. to me. Letting you down. Ah. Even those whom you admire. We're going full homo. Not all people. You've never disappointed me, Alfred. Put your hand on his lap. But I have. Put your hand on his lap. Everything that happened, I could have stopped it if I'd done something all those years ago. No, oh, no. This, this is my fault. All of it. This is a slippery slope, I Alfred. To leave your father's employ. Wouldn't have changed a thing. But if only I had the guts to do something instead. Your mother, she wanted that. Wanted to put an end to his crimes. If I'd helped her, if I'd stopped Thomas, none of these horrors would have occurred. Lady Arkham, Oswald. Uh, you're not to blame. Harvey. I don't blame you for what happened. You did the best you could in an impossible situation. And it helped to make me the man I am today. I know you're both standing, but put your hand on his lap, goddammit. Thank you, Bruce. But our work isn't done. Got really deep there. The children of Arkham are still out there. And Lady Arkham. With both Penguin Somewhere. and Mayor Dent off the board, she's the only remaining piece. The Queen. To figure out her next move. The only thing we do know is that she moved on from her plan to poison the city. Did she? When? When gone and my CEO access restored, and finally log into. Can anyone office. stop Lady Arkham? And see exactly what Oswald was doing. I wonder if Vicky wrote that one before she disappeared. If I cross-reference that with all the data we have on Vicky Vale, we might be able to figure out the children of Arkham's next move. Okay, determine the link between Oswald Cobblepot and Vicky Vale. It seems like nothing's working. Well, the Codex might be, but fuck the Codex. Your administrative access to Wayne Enterprises should have been reinstated by now, along with your title of CEO. By who? Let's see what Oswald was doing while he sat in my chair. Pissed in it, probably. Master Cobblepot's what? sense of humor hasn't changed much since you were boys. Can we just see what he was doing? Okay, so. Let's get started here. He used an image of a fake image taken while he was in Falcone's place when he first showed up in episode... Well, not first showed up. Was it the end of episode one? It was the end of episode one, actually, I think. He did this shit job here. Putting... Slapping Cobblepot over Wayne. And he couldn't, at the very least, extend it so it went past the sea there. And all the folders have penguins on them. Let's have a look at the menu. Okay, we can't use any of that. Of course we can't. I'm going to have to try typing that in somewhere as well. drs103.wayneenterprise.com Why Why is that lowercase but enterprises... Whatever. So many things that piss me off with this. Surveillance. Was tapping the surveillance systems across Gotham. Any building using Wayne Tech security could be spied on from the CEO's office. How is that any different... And the back door into the Wayne network that he uncovered. That's not different. Unless. Hold on. 
Security. Real estate. Was, was trying to buy an island. Fucking cool. Looks like he was using his new legal control of Carmine Falcone's assets and likeness to brand the place. It's some kind of tourist attraction. He was going to call it Falcone Island. Wait, what? Is in Coney Island? We need to figure out Lady Arkham's next move. Is that not a of course. I suppose New York doesn't exactly exist in this universe. So is that supposed to be a spin on like Coney Island then? Is that what that was supposed to be? Was Coney Island bought by a criminal? Oh. Oswald certainly wasn't very frugal with my money. You have a few yachts to return, it appears. Also explains how the children of Arkham had a seemingly endless supply of guns. Oswald was using way money to arm them. I don't know, I'd keep the yachts Oswald to be fair. Several public records using the Wayne network. Okay, let's have a look what he did to ours. Oswald manipulated my records as well. It would appear your degree was in sociology. I'm pretty sure that ruined him. There are some well but colourful diseases. STDs. Annoying, but not hard to fix. Uh, oh, that's better. I'm pretty sure changing his degree from whatever it was to sociology would absolutely ruin Bruce Wayne. Well, no surprise here. Oswald wiped away any trace of his criminal records. We knew that already. John is completely fabricated. Yep. He was enrolled at Cambridge. Ridiculous. Calm down, Alfred. I'm sure the board realizes by now that they were fooled. And that you told them all along. Vicky Vale. Of her birth name, Victoria Arkham, is completely gone. Mm. What's this? He also erased something from Vicky's research at the Gazette. I can't tell what was removed from here, but Wayne Tech leaves a trace when it alters data. Like One Wikipedia. Computer can be coned. What is it Miss Vale wanted to hide? No, everything from the looks of it. If you're going on a criminal... Why is that still highlighted? Is there anything else? Is there supposed to be something secret here? Do I click on his face again? Click on the X. What does the X do? Oh, that just backed me out. Okay, fuck. Okay, no. Back we go. Uh, well, that's it then. Uh, security. What do we have here? Maybe more than just look at these schematics. Every building in Gotham with a Wayne Tech security system can be accessed from here and remotely controlled. With a remote control. Vicky is the brains. Well, I'd hope someone Let's else was. She may have left clues about what she was using Oswald's access for. Ah, uh, something to do with Arkham, probably. Lady Arkham file. Bunch of newspaper clippings, apparently. Vicky or we're using the hologram. Mid thirties, reported for the Gotham Gazette, and not in the public record. Her true name, Victoria Arkham. To think she was here in the manor. She gave nothing away of her true nature then. Okay, so what have we got besides a hot hologram of her? Lady Arkham. Vicky embraced this identity to follow through on her twisted crusade. Her mask inspires fear. Not unlike Batman. Yeah, but Batman inspires fear to I do good. To find her. Scare the bad people. Uh, Children of Arkham. Children of Arkham. Her own personal army. Her symbol dates back much farther than their terrorist activity. They formed to give justice for those wronged at Arkham Asylum. But the message fell on deaf ears. Until they found a leader Gotham couldn't ignore. Okay, so the children of Arkham were already a movement, but Vicky Vale came along, became the leader, and turned them into what they are now. The Gazette's records are the articles written by Vicky Vale. This record isn't complete. You're right. There are notable gaps between entries. But yet, it doesn't seem she ever left the Gazette's employ. So what was she doing in that time? This record wouldn't be easy. and coke. Seeing what Oswald was up to could give us a fresh perspective. 
on lock. know how Oswald manipulated Vicky's records. The back computer should be able to. There. No more holes. What? What did we just do? She was looking into archive patients, reviewing records, checking submissions, prior histories. She was trying to figure out who was actually sick. Yeah, and who and wound up there because of Thomas. Hill, Falcone, and my father. Vicky Vale, Wayne Tech. Vicky was digging deep. Gotham City records, freedom of information requests, post to conspiracy forums. All to find. It's a list. Gotham buildings that use Wayne Tech security systems. It's a list of targets. City Hall, Arkham Asylum, GCPD Headquarters, Gotham First National. It's almost every landmark in the city. Yep, pretty much that's what we discussed last time. Vicky wants to bypass the security at a Gotham landmark. But without a man inside Wayne Enterprises, she can't unlock that door remotely. She'll have to get her hands It's going to be Arkham Asylum. And when she does, we'll find her. Bruce, you there? It's urgent. One of the bat prototypes has been stolen. By Lady Arkham? Not quite. I'm patching you the feed now. One of the bat prototypes. Oh my god, it's Selena Kyle. She stole from you? Oh, big shock as a thief stole. Our doors to her. After all that you two Alfred. <laughs> yeah, I know Bruce, but Well bang, okay. Why would she do this? Because she's a thief? Is she that cold hearted? Uh that sure. She must have a reason. She must have her reasons. Oh, I'm sure she does. The device she stole. It's a prototype. It's an electronic skeleton key. Oh, it so unlock any door. Bypass any security system made by Wayne Tech. Cool. That key is far too dangerous in Miss Kyle's hands. Yep. Especially with Lady Arkham still at large. Is this gonna be a choice? We're we gonna have to go after Lady Arkham or go after Selena? Because if that's a choice, I'm going to have to Lady Arkham. Okay, now we're just going straight to it. Okay. Get the electronic skeleton key back. Oh, hi there. Man, bet Bruce would feel so stupid if someone other than her came along. I wasn't expecting you. Thought I'd make it outside the city limits at least. Clearly my ride needs a tune-up. Huh. If you wanted to see me, you could have just called me. <laughs> the chase is so much more fun. But I know you're not here for me. Are you? That's a bit bulkier than I, I thought it was going to be. You for wanting it back. <laughs> Pretty important I'm thing. I'm surprised you had a toy like this. No doubt Batman would use it for the good of Gotham, but the less noble options are so much more. Yeah, still going on about this exciting. then. Exciting. Why should I give it back? So much potential. Thief of your class doesn't need a device like that. It'd only be a crutch. <laughs> Says the man whose belt is an armory. Not this one. Pure leather, baby. Catch. That was easy enough. Have you got a copy? I know you're just playing into my pride, but you're right. I don't need a crutch. <laughs> oh, come on. Don't pretend you're not impressed. As long cons go, this one was a beauty. Getting into Wayne Tech's lab took a lot more than cracking the safe. No. Oh. I had to get close to people. This is one big hoax. Harvey. Poor guy just wanted to fall in love so bad. After that, it didn't take very long to get my introduction to his BFF. <laughs> the great Bruce Wayne. Oh, is this where you tell me you didn't mean anything Imagine or you actually fell for me? The rich playboy turned out to be Batman, the scourge of Gotham. So it was all just a lie. Everything we've done to Vicky. A lie. That's how it started. Yeah, she fell for me, come on. No. I'm getting out of here while the game's good. Gotham's a house on fire, and I'm not gonna burn with it. To be fair, I thought you were already gone. 
You'd get out of here too. Nope. This town hates you. Hates your entire family. Just leave it all behind. No. -uh. Something more meaningful with those skills of yours. Like a robbing thing. You don't need the money, but but think of the fun. Maybe someday. Maybe I will be able to leave Gotham, but for now, I am the only one who can save this city. So humble. Yeah, I was just thinking that. No one else but me. Between us, after all, look at what happened to Harvey. It'd only be a matter of time before I crossed one of your lines. Isn't that right? My copy of the Boy Scout Handbook is out of date. I'm bound to break some rule. Yeah. So you know I would never hurt you, Bruce. That's really sweet. But it brings us to the root of our problem, doesn't it? You're upset that I'm leaving. Of course. What'd you think? That one night of sex meant you were going steady? Is that what you really thought? Oh, we're gonna bring it in. No, maybe it meant nothing to you, but what happened between us meant something to me. Oh, Bruce. Didn't know you were the sensitive type. Just stop the show, Selena. Stop pretending nothing matters. <sighs> Look, Bruce. I'll admit it came on a little happened. strong there. It wasn't terrible. But you were just another job. A more intriguing job than I was expecting. But still a job. And that job's done. I'm done with you. It's not complicated. I'm not a good person. I'm certainly no hero, and I don't want to be. I'm a thief. That's all I am. That's not true. I told you that from the start. That's impossible. I to be anything else. Stop. It's not true. I know there's more to you than that. You're just afraid to admit it. You'd like it if that were true, wouldn't you? Why would you even think that? I've made my feelings pretty clear. Why aren't you listening? Uh, at the very least, you saved my life. My life. You could have left me to die back in that warehouse, but you didn't. Someone who's only out for herself, who's just a thief, wouldn't do that. Oh yeah? Who would? A good person. That's who. A hero. Man, this music is really fitting the whole fucking with her yeah. mindset thing. After I found out you were bad. I thought nothing else could surprise me, but you just keep on surprising me. I think I'll let the moment... Fuck that. However, check you've still got the thing in your back pocket afterward. Something to remember me by. <laughs> I won't need any help remembering you. Well, it's been fun. I think that went pretty well as far as encounters go. Uh, stay out of trouble. Stay out of trouble. It's not true, but catch you taking what's not yours again. I'll have to stop you. I look forward to our next dance. Yeah, try not to scratch my face next time. I'll try not to punch your lights in. Lucius, I've got the key. Uh, hold on, Alfred's on the line. Hey, Alfred, I... Bruce! Lady Arkham! She's here! I, I tried to keep them out, but... Alfred? Alfred! Oh, and we're going to have to end it there. God damn it. Right as it was getting good. Okay, so... This part was interesting. We had our final goodbye with Selina, even though I thought she'd left last episode. And she could have even potentially have left the episode before that, so... It's actually kind of been a while coming. And now we know that Lady Arkham is at Bruce Manor with... Alfred. So that's uh, no bueno. However, we'll have to find out what happens next time. So thank you very much for watching, guys. And see you next part.